Have you ever wondered what kinds of gadgets are too dangerous or too controversial to be sold openly? Today, we're gonna explore the shadiest corners of the tech world to uncover the top 10 banned gadgets that you can still get your hands on. From gadgets that can be used to break into cars, to ones that can be used to spy on your neighbors. These devices are not for the faint of heart, so grab some popcorn and get ready to be amazed by what's out there. First up, we've got the sneaky little RFID card skimmer. This bad boy is a favorite among credit card thieves, allowing them to swipe your sensitive information while you're busy picking out snacks at the convenience store. These crafty criminals work in pairs. While one distracts the store owner with the fake questions about the price of the bag of chips, the other sneaks over to the payment terminal and slaps on this tiny device. From up to 3.3 feet away, the skimmer can copy all your credit card deets faster than you can say identity theft. And it's not just your average shopaholic that these thieves are after. They're particularly interested in snagging the key cards used in factories and other large businesses, but really the possibilities for information gathering are endless. Your imagination is only the limit. Believe it or not, there are still some folks out there who are willing to drop a hundred bucks on this little guy. Up next on our list of banned gadgets that you can still get your hands on is the Y phone. This pint-sized phone packs a punch with its unique features that lets you maintain your independence and privacy. And weighing in at only 3 ounces, it's light as a feather. Even if you don't own a SIM card, you can still make calls by signing up for the SIP account on any platform that works. Once connected to a Wi-Fi network, you can talk to your heart's content. And get this, the phone's daughterboard is super flexible and can even be enlarged to turn into a radio-controlled car or music studio. Talk about versatility. With a battery life of up to 8 hours, you won't have to cut your conversations short. Plus, the buttons on the Y phone can be customized to do all sorts of things. Want to launch your favorite app with just one click? Done. Need to set a reminder to buy more snacks? No problem. Number 3 on our list of banned gadgets that are still up for grabs is the GSM Jammer. This sneaky device sends out a signal without information, effectively blocking any nearby cell phone reception. And the best part? It can be assembled right in the comfort of your own home. For those who aren't so handy with DIY projects, there are pre-made models available for purchase on the civilian market. One website based in China offers these jammers for a price that's just shy of 300 bucks, but buyer beware, these gadgets are banned for a reason and using one could land you in some serious hot water with a law. Our next gadget on the list is the Flipper Zero, the Swiss Army Knife for nerds. This little device may look like a video game console, but it's anything but childish. In fact, it's the ultimate tool for controlling smart home devices and gates from up to 164 feet away. Plus, it's got some seriously cool features. With the ability to store information and simulate touch memory, the Flipper Zero is the ultimate key to all your tech needs. And get this, its keys are compatible with the AM4100 and Hide Proxy keycards that can be used to control everything from TVs to air conditioners. So say goodbye to those clunky remotes and say hello to the future. The Flipper Zero is designed for frequent use and is equipped with a micro SD card slot that can hold up to 64 gigabytes of data. And the cherry on top, it can run for up to a week on a single charge. This is one gadget you won't want to leave home without. Up next, we have the Dother Watch, the ultimate gadget for the tech savvy. This smartwatch is something straight out of Hollywood, complete with all the usual features like custom firmware, games, and other content, but what really sets it apart is its ability to test the security of Wi-Fi networks. With the Dother Watch, you can imitate a hacker's attack and check just how secure a Wi-Fi network really is. It's as simple as finding an open Wi-Fi hotspot, choosing the access point you want to test, and letting the watch do its thing. This is one gadget that's not for the faint of heart, but for those who love a good tech challenge, the Dother Watch is sure to provide endless hours of fun and excitement. So, if you're ready to put your skills to the test, be sure to get your hands on one of these banned gadgets before they're gone for good. Before we move on to the next 5 banned gadgets that you can still buy, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so you can stay up to date on all the latest tech news and gadget reviews. And trust us, you won't want to miss what's coming up next. We've got some truly jaw-dropping gadgets still to come, so make sure to stick around till the end. Number 6 on our list of banned gadgets is the Mizu Spy Glasses. These high-tech glasses come equipped with a 1920x1080 resolution camera that can capture crystal clear video. The best part? The video is saved in the convenient AVI file format and automatically cut into 10 minute pieces by a machine. Plus, a full charge only takes 50 minutes and requires just 1.2 ounces of battery. 
While these spy glasses were banned for their potential misuse, the company that makes them believes that they could also be used as dash cams or baby monitors, making them a versatile and useful gadget for everyday life. But don't let their practical uses fool you. With these spy glasses, you'll always be ready to capture the unexpected and intriguing, so why not add a pair to your collection today and see what adventures await? Next up, we have emergency strobe lights. That's right, they're not just for the police anymore, these bad boys come in all shapes and sizes. Need a disco ball for your next dance party? Grab the one with 26 lighting modes. Want to spice up date night? The romantic version promises to set the mood. Just don't blame us if the flashing lights give you a headache instead of a love connection. But in all seriousness, emergency strobe lights can be a helpful tool for safety on the road. Just be sure to use them responsibly and not cause any distractions or accidents. And please, don't use them as a makeshift disco ball at your next party. Your guests will thank you. Number 8 on our list of banned gadgets is the license plate hider. Perfect for those who want to hide their true identity from the authorities or just want to feel like a secret agent on their daily commute. With a push of a button, the license plate flipping technology can quickly rotate two plates 180 degrees and change the numbers on them, making it virtually impossible for anyone to track your whereabouts. Now, we're not saying that you should use this for illegal activities, but let's face it, it's always better to be safe than sorry. Plus, it's a great way to keep those pesky traffic cameras from catching you when you're in a rush. But wait, there's more! This gadget also doubles as a party trick. Impress your friends by showing off your license plate flipping skills and watch their jaws drop in amazement. It's the perfect addition to any car enthusiast collection and who knows, it might save you from a speeding ticket or two. Next up, we've got the high powered laser. Forget about lightsabers, this laser is so powerful it could make Darth Vader blush. With the ability to punch a hole through a folded yoga mat or a shirt, you'll have a weapon stronger than any Jedi or Sith. Sellers claim it has a range of 5 to 6 miles, making it perfect for hunting, hiking, or even lighting up a concert stage. But beware, this laser is so intense that it can cause serious eye damage, so please don't try using it to pick up your neighbor from across the street. May the force be with you, but maybe not with this laser. And finally, let's take a look at the Turbo Decoder, a tool that can open car locks with ease. Sellers claim this little gadget is a masterpiece of precision mechanics, but let's be real, it's just a fancy lock picker. The tool was designed for car mechanics, but anyone can get their hands on it if they're feeling a bit mischievous. The turbo decoder is specially intended for opening HU83 type locks made between 2006 and 2017, but there are also models for other locks available. The best part is, you don't need any special skills to use it. Just insert the tool into the lock, give it a little jiggle, and presto, the door is open. Alright folks, that's all from our side, and now we'd like to hear from you. Have you ever used any of these banned gadgets before? Would you consider buying any of them? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you found it entertaining and subscribe to the channel for more exciting content. See you in the next one.